Hey friends, this is Kathy and you're watching Kathy at Home. Right now I'm in the car. I'm about to go get my hair done for the first time since we moved to Colorado, so wish me luck. Um, I've got a little video for you today. It is my fall hutch decor. So um, I hope you'll enjoy that and it gives you some motivation. I did not go out and buy anything for this. I just used what I had and um, you know, I may change it again, <laughs> who knows. Um, I also have a few things that I got at Goodwill. If you've been watching my channel, you know the Goodwill that's near my house is da bomb. And I found some more really nice things for the kitchen and some other prints for uh, the dining room and the hallway. So that will be at the end. So stay tuned for that. Watch till the end. Um, I have decided, someone gave me some great advice. One of my, one of my friends said that maybe I'll hang on to those, um, you know, those molds that I was asking people to give me advice on where to hold them. I mean, where to hang them. Um, your brain just doesn't work as well as it should when you're in your 60s anyway. Um, and they are kind of springy. So I think I am going to wait. Um, my next question is, I've got my blue and white plates and I've got large ones and small ones and I've got quite a few and I've put hangers on all of them. Should I put those up in the kitchen and the dining room? So let me know in the comments what you think. Um, or should I just leave it the way it is? Cause I don't want to do too much. And sometimes I'll go and do a little too much. So in this house, I promised myself I wasn't going to do that, but Anyway, I hope I haven't done too much. I'm just trying to make it cozy and homey. And there's so many things that I like. <laughs> and I want to put them all on the walls anyway. So stay till the end. Give me some of your advice, my friends, because I know you've got some great advice for me. I hope that this, um, you enjoy this video. I'm not going to talk a whole lot through it. I've got some funky music for you to listen to. So I <laughs> hope you enjoy that. And I hope today is finding you ha happy and healthy. And I'm going to get started now. Here we go. So I decorated my hutch for fall. I did not buy anything new. I just used what I already had. So let's take a look at what we go got going on here with this hutch. You may see some familiar items because these aren't new. <laughs> I shopped my house to decorate this hutch and the vast majority, not everything, but I would say 85% of the, you hear my dogs barking, 85% of these items were thrifted. You know, if I can thrift it, I'm going to do it. So anyway, sit back, relax, get yourself something nice to drink and enjoy.
I hope you enjoyed my little tour of my fall hutch and now I'm going to show you some items that I have newly thrifted from Goodwill. Here we go! I found two of these prints at Goodwill and they were $16.99 each. Um, they are matted and they've got some kind of like fabric in the matting. It's so pretty. But uh, one of them I have hung in my dining room, which is this one. And in just a second, I'll show you the one that I hung in the hallway. These prints are definitely my jam because I just love this kind of traditional uh, decor and these are just so pretty. Um, I don't know. Could you get anything for $16.99 like that in a retail shop? I don't think so, but look how pretty that is. Gorgeous. And then I found these items that are kind of below where my hen and my chicken, my rooster are. <laughs> and I just love these. Now I had to do a little bit of fixing on them. Um, I happen to have some sage green paint. So even though this uh, frame on, on those were distressed, um, I went ahead and did a little bit of work on them. And the Bon Appetit sign, is a Hobby Lobby sign. Um, I forgot how much I paid. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but I cleaned it up, and I went around the edges of it with a black permanent marker because it was just, you know, a little bit worn. And I just think this looks super cute up here. Let me know in the comments what you think, but I'm really loving it. It's like a 3D picture of lemons and pears. And with what I've already got up there, it, you know, it gives me that sort of cottagey, French country, English cottage, whatever vibe that I like. <laughs> Tell me what you think. I found two of these really large, I guess, they're like supposed to hang off of something. Uh, I don't know what you would call that anyway. <laughs> of this greenery and it was in really nice condition it looked brand new um found that at goodwill and i thought i would dress up the top of my fridge and i put a burlap uh, runner um up there with one of my fitz and floyd pieces with the greenery and i think it looks pretty cute so again, let me know what you think about that. Well, that's all I've got for you today, friends. Lily and I say thank you so much for watching, and I will talk with you soon. You guys take care. Bye-bye.